Hi guys, how's it going? Welcome to my virgin kitchen. Today, I'm with my mum. All right, mum, say hello. Hi there. <laughs> Hi there. And we have just made this wicked baked fish and chip recipe. It's actually got smoked haddock in it. it smells good. Let's go. Ah, uh, there's a place in your house where it's cool to chill. Get some me time or even cook a meal. It's your kitchen mofo, ain't no time to slack. So just grab yourself a penny and let's work that ass. If you're scared of this place, ain't no need to bother. Just lay down your weapons and pick up another. Right ho, so we're here with my mum in the kitchen. Are you good at cooking, mum? Not this particularly, is my mom. No. no. She's doled up for the occasion and uh, yeah, that's all I'm gonna say about it. I feel very underdressed, so, aren't you mum? Yeah, and you need to get your tie on. I need to, I need to wear my tie. So we're gonna make fish and chips. Fish and chips? Yeah. Uh, it doesn't look like fish and chips. Doesn't look like, right. So we've got all the ingredients there. You've got to click your fingers. Right, okay. My mum just clicked her fingers. Hit pause on the video and write them all down. I've started to do it already. We're going to make our chips first. You basically slice up your potatoes into nice little chips like that. Mum, do you want to have a go at that? There's a big knife there for you. Want to have a go? Give it a go. Right. Go on in. Look at my mum. All dressed up. Look at that. Now, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Peeling it. Yeah, you don't have to peel it. I just did it quite those rough. Are, just... Those are peeled. Yeah, no, just cut them into squares and then just chop them into chips. Yeah. No, no, no. Okay. Just cut them anywhere you want. Okay, so mum is uh, pat drying the uh, chips. For some reason you're doing them like a little bit one by one. Why don't you just chuck them all in there? Just rub them all like that. Get some more kitchen time. Don't want to it's like she's cleaning your... them, like cleaning the car or something. Don't want to ruin your style because you've got them all lined up like soldiers. It's alright, it's alright. Right, so my mum right now is putting the chips into that big mixing bowl right there. You see that mixing bowl right there? That's what she's doing. That's an exciting step. And then she's going to drench it in olive oil and pepper and salt and all stuff you want to add to it. You can make it amazing. Isn't that right, mum? That's right. That's right. That's right. What? <laughs> you don't know what you're doing. How much do you want? Just drizzle a load on there. That's it. Nice handful of it. Like, yeah. Well, if you get your hands in it, or you can use that spatula, just to stir it around and coat it. Spatula. It is a spatula. That's all right. Yes, but I don't want to get my hands in it, do I? I don't have to coat it too much. You're not making a cake. Right. All right. That's the pepper, Mum. You're supposed to take the lid off, right? Have you done this previously? <laughs> no. Just, it just flips off. Yeah. Pop it off like that. Ah. Alright, there we go. Just grind it on there. You've got to twist it. Ah. No, it's upside down. My dad did that as well. That's <laughs> 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 awkward. Mum's been interrupted um, for this that? cooking video by a little phone call. No, yeah, it's, it's fine because I'm just going to wait here. I'm not hungry or anything. On the settee, you think? Anyone saying that my mum's a MILF? Shut up. No, okay. don't worry. Ready for the next bit? I'm ready. How ready are you? Ready! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, mum, get your chips on a baking tray like that. That baking tray is well used. It's been used for so long. Are you proud of me learning to cook? Oh, I'm so proud, Barry. It's really good. My mum can't cook very much, can you, mum? I used to, but not now. What What's your uh, perfect dish now? What's your best dish that you make? Mm, now? Mm, probably... Mm, I don't know. Mm. <laughs> fast food. I'm good at cakes. Good, good at cakes. It's right, so at my mum's house you have cakes for breakfast, lunch and dinner pretty much. So uh, you're making something a bit different. Are you excited by this? Yeah, I am. It's different. Right, so my mum is just scattering around those chips. We've got the cracked black pepper on them like so. I'm going to whack them in the oven, they take about 40 minutes and they're going to time this whole recipe up and we chuck all the other stuff in around it and then in 40 minutes time it should be done. Right mum? That's it. Right, right, you're poking it around like that. Just... I, yes, but I like precision. Yeah, it's precision, but come on, it's just a bit of chips. We're just going to tear into it in a bit anyway. It doesn't really matter, it's all going to go down the same way, right? Um, so we've got to get it in the oven now mum. You're going to preheat your oven? We should have preheated our oven right at the start, shouldn't we? Oh, uh, whoops. Whoops, whoops. Preheat your oven. But I don't know you. No, you've got to have a go at doing the oven. That's the oven, yeah, but you need to put, you need to turn it on first. Right. right, I'll give you a clue. That's the oven, temperature one, and you need to give it a bit of gas and a bit of ignition. <laughs> no. One, no. There we go. I keep it there. Oh. What are you doing? It's on. 
No, it's not. Well, you're just gonna gas this all out, right? I'm gonna have to take over here. Just don't wanna oh. smell gas. Yeah. Not good. Okay, so although the oven isn't properly preheated, my mum is chucking those chips in there. We're gonna move on now to make some funky breadcrumbs and some peas and stuff. You're gonna love it. You alright then, mum? Is that what you want Needs a special knack. I'll give it a slam <laughs> now. What was that noise? <laughs> okay, so now we move on to the very easy step of uh, chopping a pepper, which my mum... Do you know how to cut a pepper, mum? It's not something I normally do, no. Because so, uh, nobody in the family likes them. I like peppers. I like but I know a lot of people that do. So, we're going to let my mum cut the pepper any way she likes and uh, see what happens. But don't put the seeds in your eyes. Not good. Hey, I tell you what, that's a good start. She's just cut the lid off. Now those white things in there, Mum, you don't want to touch them, all right? They're seeds, all right? What are you doing? Hey, you're doing it. Yeah, fair play. It's all right. She's like a master chef in my kitchen. Look at this. Look at this. Why didn't you ever teach me? Why didn't you ever teach me? Why didn't you ever teach me how to cook? <laughs> right, just to show you, this is my mum's effort. It's not too bad. There's the odd one or two seeds in there, but some people like chopping it with seeds. But like I say, just remember to... Keep your hands clean and get rid of those seeds that you don't want. You don't want people eating them and stuff. Yeah, you're just cutting them up in the rings, Mum. You've cut a pepper before, what are you on about? Oh, I've, I've never done this before, honestly. It's about that, cutting it all up. It's amazing. Look at this. Any comment? Or? No, I'm concentrating. Mm. Okay, my mum is happy with her peppers. Are you happy with your peppers, Mummy? I am happy with the peppers. How happy oh. are you with the peppers? Oh, so happy. Apart from this one that got away. Excuse me. That's, just, that's not even a pepper, so I can that's, Yeah, but we don't want that in it, do we? No, we don't, Mum. We, we don't want that in there. Uh, okay, so here are some leeks which we're going to use to make a funky mushy pea and minty thing at the end with butter and lemon. <gasps> Does that sound good? Does that sound good? What did I just say? Butter and lemon. Is that it? What else is in it? Just, we're just going to have butter and lemon. Ooh. Anything else? Like, how about the leeks? I just... Leeks. Funky uh, leeks. Funky. Funky leeks. And peas. All right, cut the nasty bit off the end, and then we're going to boil them up, but you might as well cut them up into like chunks. Like give them like about an inch or two on each side, like when you cut it. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> What's that funny? <laughs> um, okay, so we've got some leeks there and some peppers, which my mum has kindly chopped up. Now, speaking of chopping, we've got something here called a mini chopper, and I'm not talking about my dad. We're talking about <laughs> <laughs> my stepdad, right? Oh, no. <laughs> I can't say that. I can't say that. Um, okay, so what we're going to do is make some funky breadcrumbs to go on our fish. Right, Mum? You're wicked. Sorry. Right. Let's so, do what we've this. got is some parsley, a loaf of bread, and some lemon, but we're just going to get the zest off that and use the lemon juice later on for our, our peas and uh, leeks thing. Is that okay, Mum? Yeah. So, what I want to do is to tear up that bread and just shove that parsley in there. Get it all in there, okay? Yeah. Alright, so my mum's crammed the bread and the parsley in there, and now you've got a zest in <laughs> working out which one's the sharp side. Hmm? <laughs> no, 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 don't zest it on there, just zest it over the chopper. Oh, right. No, you do it on the flat side. Oh, no, that is the rough side, but you do it upside down. Do it upside down. Confusing me. Why don't you do it the other way around so that the lens zest falls in, mum? Does that make sense, or...? Penny's dropped. Okay, so my mum's put so much lemon in there, it's almost like turning into a lemon rank pie. Okay, just warning you, mum, okay? You ready to do it? Blast it. Yeah. Making breadcrumbs. Yeah, I was going to say, you could stop now. Just sort of sit there. You're enjoying that a bit too much, aren't you? That we should fun. have. Was that fun? Yeah. Amazing. Um, we should have some wicked breadcrumbs oh. in there now. Happy oh, with that? Oh, it smells good. Does it smell of lemon? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not surprised it smells of lemon. <laughs> Was that a laugh? <laughs> okay, so the next step right now, you might be able to see in the background, my mum is uh, getting the haddock fish, which we're using, it's quite pongy, smoked haddock. Does that smell smoky to you, mum? It's very smoky. Smoky. It smells good. It smells good, yeah. Okay, so we're getting our fish in there, and then giving it a drench in olive oil. Oh yeah. Go for it, mum, however much you want. And that's just gonna hold as a little bit of a glue. And then we're gonna pat these breadcrumbs in that my mum made just over here. See how much lemon zest is in there? Oh, it's all stuck down the bottom there as well. Crazy, so there we go. That's gonna go patted on there. All right, all right, easy now. 
Okay, so just like Mary Poppins scattering seeds for all the pigeons, my mum is putting breadcrumbs, stuffing it. Did you like that? Don't mention pigeons. Why not? No, not my favourite. My mum doesn't like pigeons. I wish I had a pigeon outfit. That'd be amazing <laughs> right now. Just come in as a big pigeon. Go, mummy! Uh, yeah, so look at that. My mum's coating that fish up. Let me get around here so I can see it a bit better. I'm doing this. Why? Are you excited? Yeah. You're doing really well so far, mum. Right, it's time to put on my chef's hat because I need to take the lead role here. My mum is turning up to washing up duties. Um, I want to thank my American mum. You've never met my American mum, have you, Cindy? Never. My American mum, Cindy, I spent a year in America. And this mum is my real mum. And Cindy is my American mum who got me this hat. Hi, Cindy. All right? You're just washing up? I'm washed up. Right, okay, so my mum, look at that fish. That looks devastatingly good. Do you agree? I do, it's, it is looking Give good. Give me a word or a song or something that can sum up how good that fish looks right now. Fantastical. It needs work, it needs work. Okay, so into that fish tray. We're nearly done with the fish tray, believe it or not. It just needs 20 minutes blast in that open. Right, Mum? Uh, she is cutting up some cherry tomatoes right now, Mum, aren't you? I am. Enjoying that? Yes, if they keep still. Right, okay. So then the cherry tomatoes, once they're halved, we're going to find little rooms. We're going to push gaps in there and away from the fish. And also the peppers are going to go in there with it as well. And then we'll just move on to our leeks and peas and mint and butter. Whoop. Right. Right, Mum, you want to tell me what you're doing right now? I've just placed the pepper and the tomatoes in the gaps around the fish. Talking very posh. My mum doesn't normally talk like that. She's normally a bit like, yeah, just like put the peppers on, innit? Aren't you, mum? Yeah? You say so. Yeah. What's the matter? <laughs> it's the pain of cooking, mum. Feel that burn. Feel it. What's the matter? <laughs> what? Stop. Stop filming. That's the idea of my version of kitchen. We film. Women in the kitchen, we film. Right? Is that yes. alright? You okay? Yes. Do some Pilates. <sighs> Is that Pilates? No, that's plie. Oh. Um, right, so now we're going to make our funky peas and le uh, le leaky stuff. Does that fill you with satisfaction? Yes, <laughs> let's do it. Come on. That's motivation right there, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> that's better. Wow! Woo! High five, Mum. Yeah. <laughs> How are you feeling? Yeah, I'm good. I'm waiting to get those chips out of the oven. <laughs> so, get the chips out of the oven. There's your oven gloves. Go for it, that has been 20 minutes, we are halfway through. Can you believe it? Time flies when you're having fun with your mum in the kitchen. Uh, <laughs> you okay? Not really. I didn't set you up for that. It is quite a tough oven door to open, but only I know how to use that oven door. Uh, so there we go, mum's getting them out, looking good. What we're gonna do is give them a little shimmy. So maybe get a fish slice and just shake them up a little bit, and then back in the oven for another 20 minutes. Can I see them, mum? Can I have a little look? You can. Yeah, they're looking good, they're looking good. So they're nearly there. Halfway through. Watch your hand, don't burn your hand, Mum. This might take a while. You alright? Yeah. Okay, so do you shimmy them all up? I've Give shimmy. them a good shimmy. Good shimmy. I'm shimmy. <laughs> okay, we could just shimmy all night, but we've got to cook. So, right, yeah, go on the top shelf for the minute. Maybe about five more minutes on the top shelf for the chips. The fish is going to go in on the bottom for now. Oh my goodness. Happy, Mum? It's Yes, looking good. Delicious. I moved Ooh. the pan of water over just while my mum got that out, by the way, because I didn't want to scold herself. Well, that would have been quite good footage. I would have felt quite bad. You did it. Oh! <laughs> no, not quite. <laughs> What's the matter with you? I want to get my leeks in. Well, get your leeks in then. That water's all nice and boiled up now. My mum's doing that. I'm only going to need about seven or eight minutes of that, and then the, the leeks to sort of, sort of wilt like that a little bit. Not too much, so they don't break down fully. Like, oh, break down, mum. I'm going to break down. No, not today. Come on. Uh, yeah, so we're going to do that. And we chuck some peas in for another minute. And then we get it in our mini chopper again with some mint and some butter. Is that exciting? Yeah. Excited. OK, I feel it's important that while I've got my mum in the kitchen and we're waiting for the leeks to finish off cooking that we ask her some, you know, maybe a question. Like, What's your most uh, favourite memory of me, mum? Any memories? <laughs> memory. Uh, any <laughs> memories? Any? I think I've got lots of memories of you, yes. Any? Um, so you take a pick, but... What about when you were little and you tried on my red high heel boots and they came right up like thigh length? I'm worried about you then, so... I don't do that or anymore. Was, you're always like dressing up. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's what I'm doing in the videos. Red high heel boots in future videos. Is that a good one, Mum? If you've got a knee, have you? 
Right, those leeks have been in there for probably just over six minutes. We've probably overcooked it, but we've just been reminiscing, haven't we, Mum? We've been talking about the past. Oh. Scared of picture. <laughs> yeah? Um, so we're going to pour our peas in now, just a handful of those. In they go, Mum. Brush them in. Don't be shy now. Oh, yeah. Okay. So they are not going to take very long at all. In fact, they're not even peas. They are, well, in fact, they are peas. Sometimes people call them petit pois. Do you know what petit pois is, Mum? Petit pois. It's a small pea. It's a small pea. It's a small pea. Okay, uh, so they're just going to boil away for a little bit. Peas aren't going to take very long. And then we whack them in that chopper. Where's my mum gone? All done. Okay, so my mum has just poured in the leeks and the peas. I'll just shove it in there. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Just sit it up on the top there, mum. What did we just do? Do you <laughs> <laughs> um, what's the matter with your hand? It's heavy! It's only a saucepan. Um, my mum basically just drained off the leeks and the peas because they were ready and then what we're going to do is now chuck them in our chopper again with some butter and some mint. Is that... What was that sorry for? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Come on then, let's, let's put it in. <clears throat> right mum, tell everyone what you're going to do. We're going to place the leeks and the petit pois into the chopper. Mm. Voila! Oh, look at this, man. This is good. Look at that angle. She's spooning it in with care. You could just pour it all in in one go, but it'll just go everywhere, right? Yeah, we don't want it going everywhere. We want it in the chopper. <laughs> yeah, that's really important advice, Mum. <laughs> that's a really important step. Well done. Thank right. you. Okay. My mum is armed with a spoon. What are you going to do with that, Mum? Hopefully, put these... No, you don't need to spoon the mint in. You can pick that with your hands. It's all right. That is mint going in. That is mint, right? Yes. You know what mint is? Cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You like Did that? Did you get that? Did you get that from in the garden? No, I got it from the supermarket. Sorry. Uh, so get a spoonful of butter now, Mum. Just a little... Wow, that's a lot. Okay, that's fine. Just chuck it in there. And the heat that's in there with those leeks and the peas should melt that through. Oh, can you see that sliding down? Oh, my goodness. That will break down soon. Get your lid on and whiz it up. Serious whizzing face. What about that? What about it? You tell me. You're the cooker. You're the cooker. You're the chef. You're the cooker. I'm the cooker. I, are you the cooker I'm right the there? Cooker. Oh my gosh! Right there, we got a cooker in our kitchen. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's my mum cooking in my kitchen. Oh, look at that! Wicked, minty, mushy peas with leeks in there, and that is going to be zing tastic. I used to hate mushy peas. That's going to taste alright. We doing? Is it nice? Ooh. I just want to apologise to my mum because we started getting like, some sort of side on shots like that. She's quite nervous and catching her when I can, but you might just see the hair. You see the hair there? And then the nose and then the mouth like that. I'm very shy. So uh, we'll, we'll get her out of her shell. Maybe we'll do some more videos. Would you like to do more videos for me, mum? Maybe. That's a no. Okay. <laughs> Does it taste good? Mmm, it does. Let's have a taste. Give me a hand there. Oh, you've got a big, oh, it's still warm. big lump then. I'm hungry. Right, it's time. The fish is done, the chips are done. We're going to serve it up. Mummy presentation style, right? Yeah, let's go for it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you alright there? Huh? <laughs> 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 what is that? When they said that? Oh, it's fine. Um, yeah, so my mum is really enjoying the chips to the point where they just literally got them out there and just stuffing them right down. The fish and the the peppers and the tomato and all that are all nice and done in there. We're going to get on our plate with our mushy peas. What's the matter? I'm trying to do a cooking video here and my mum's in the background like doing an advert for back pain going, Oh my God. Are you okay? Are you okay? Not really. We love you, Mrs. Barry's mum. Nanny Barry. <laughs> Nanny Barry. <laughs> uh, let's play it up. Sorry, let's, let's go. Okay, so we've got a steaming hot pile there of the fish, the peppers, the tomatoes, the chips and the, uh, ah, woo, uh, the mushy peas <laughs> over there. Was that funny? Not really. Okay, so what we're going to do, rather than rushing my mum through all this, we're just going to get her to the old classic click your finger thing, and then it will just appear on a plate. Do you want to do that, mum? Do you want to put your fingers right there and click? Bit lower down there. Bit louder. Bit lower down there again. Okay, that'll do. Not loud enough click? No. Oh, I can't do You're strong. I'm not strong. What are you on about? Well, I've got a strong No. That was better. Eh? That was better. Oh, can I carry on now? Oh, do it again down there. Okay, kaboom! That is all on one big plate. Mum, do you want to hold me that plate up and show me it? What is it? What is it looking like? Looking good? 
It looks fantastic. You've got the fish on there, you've got the tomatoes and the peppers, that big pile of mushy peas and the chips. Are you excited? We're excited. <sighs> She's really trying. <laughs> so are you. Yeah. Right, honey, guys, we're all done. It smells, the kitchen smells <sighs> amazing in here, not just because of the perfume my mum is wearing, right? Oh no, I dropped a tomato on the table. <laughs> <laughs> so let's have a taste and see what it's like. Right, Mum? Ready? Ready? Go. I really like that. Do you like that, Mum? It tastes lovely. It tastes lovely. So if my mum can make that, absolutely anyone in the world can. Have a go for yourself. Let us know how you get on. I'll see you again next time. Right? Bye. Oh, my mummy. <laughs> my mummy. Right ho, my mum is carrying on eating. This is rare for you, Mum. You just eat biscuits and, and air. My mum doesn't eat that much, do you? That's how she keeps her figure. That's why I'm fat. You like that, right? It's delicious, really good. What did you just say to me off camera? It made me feel really emotional. <laughs> <laughs> no? no <laughs> okay, I don't know if I put any alcohol in that fish, but my mum said she liked it. And she really mm -hmm. liked it. She's inspired. She's not going to do fry-ups anymore. And that is what we're all about. We make some healthy food, inspire people like my mum. No, it's I'll, not too I'll late. It's not too late. Definitely do it again. Will you? Okay. Uh, and we'll let there's, you know there's, your, there's your £10 note. Right. <laughs> <laughs> See you next time. Bye.